go around and trim around the blank, make sure it's good and square. I'm going to cut a quarter inch profile around the body. That just lets me know where I'm working. That's just for my purpose only. And let's get it all sanded up. I sanded it quite a few times, trying to make sure we got the thickness correct. And also, especially on the bottom. Top doesn't matter because it's going to be carved. Start with, we're going to actually mill out the top where the lid goes. We're going down 1.5 inch. Slightly deeper, that way we have a little bit of room for uh, doing a little bit of sanding on the top and you know filling in the uh, pores. Now we're starting to mill out the pockets. And the pot cavity is going to be an angle in the bottom because of the contour of the carving on the top of the list ball. I don't cut this out that fast. I've actually sped up the video. I cut it out a lot slower just to make sure that I got a good, clean cut. Now we're drilling the pot cavity holes. Three way. Those are the insert holes for the brass inserts. will be cut with like screws. That's better than using wood screws. You can take them in and out many times without distorting the hole. The bottom of that, you see, it looks like a little glue. When I was gluing it, the top fell into the trench, and it's still a little bit wet. But as you can tell, it goes into the maple there. Yeah, this is the rough car. And again, it's sped up to make it faster for the video, but I do not cut it that fast because I want a good, smooth profile. The rough carbon, as you can tell, it's not a smooth cut. It's just knocking off the bulk of the wood. Then the finishing bit will come back with a ball nose and it will clean it up and make it very, very smooth. You can see the curl. This blank had some nice curl in it, so the finish should come out extraordinary. Still debating what finish. If any of you guys has any suggestions, uh, leave them in the comments. Now we're doing the finishing the ball nose bit, which has been sped up.
I'm cutting a half inch deep down into the bit. The blank, I'm not going to cut through the blank. I just want to clean some of the edges up, which I still will have to cut in. I'll bring the offset in just a little bit. This is just a little bit on the outside. And I think I'm going to make a double binding on this one. I mean a triple binding, but on both the top and the bottom. As you can see the curl real nicely. I put a little naphtha on it to bring the curl out. Part three. Part three is going to bring us the middle of your neck, pocket, and so forth, and finishing up on the middle of the body. So please stay tuned for the next video. Thank you for listening and watching our videos.